I'm Jamie Oliver from the Oliver's Mad House and today I'm going to be reviewing the Britax Be Ready push chair. This particular model, the Be Ready, has the ability to be used um, multiple different ways and you can adjust it from being a, a solo push chair to actually being a, a dual push chair so you can use it with either two different age ranges of children or in fact you can use it for twins. I've only reviewed this particular product while it's been in single mode so I'm going to give you my views and opinions just on that. The oversized hood and the ability to fold that in if you want to or pop that back out. Peekaboo on the top with magnetic fastening so no noisy velcro. In order to lay the seat unit back because it does move as a whole unit it's really simple it's here on the back towards you and then you can obviously adjust the seat unit to what your little one may need. The other particularly nifty feature that I really really loved about this push chair is the brake. It's flip flop friendly, click on it turns red, click off it turns green. Once it's green you're good to go. I also really like um, this push chair in solo mode for the fact it's got a humongous basket at the bottom here. The, how this works is basically there's two clips on the side. It looks a bit like a, a hair grip inside, so it's, uh, it's quite sturdy. And then you clip those back together, poppers, and then you can refold that back into there. So if you are turning into a dual mode push chair, that's obviously uh, reduce the basket size but it gives you the ability to obviously use the second seat unit. Comes with a bumper bar when I've got a little one in there and I'm trying to put it back in you have to physically pull the material back up so it doesn't get trapped in order to clip it back on so it's a little bit fiddlier than I think it needs to be. Had they cut it short just just here like some of the other bar, bumper bars on the Britax push chairs that would, would have worked far better I think but still uh, standard issue Britax five point harness system. I absolutely, I love pen facing. It's, it's probably my my favourite mode for the ones. Seat unit's fairly nimble and quite light. It just clips on. Once you've heard it click, it's fitted. I think this has particularly been done for when it's in dual mode, but the basket. On the front here comes with a zip. Comes with a foam handlebar uh, with a centre one handed push, which is obviously really simple. It's got the adjustable bar, grey buttons on the inside, squeeze, and you can adjust for different heights. It's also really, really simple to flatten and pop into the car. Now you can do this two ways. You can either do it with the push chairs forward facing, and that's the same if it's in dual mode, you can use them forward facing and still recline the push chair and pop it in the boot. Or you can take it off and obviously do it with the frame only. Now these gray connectors on the side here, pull them towards you on both, both of them and drop. To un unlock it, there's a catch on one side, squeeze it, and it's back out again, and it clicks. Um, I'll just show you with the seat attached. Again, it's always best to break on, pull to towards you, and drop. Now that's it, you can obviously adjust that and lift the whole unit. It does make a difference on the weight, obviously I didn't see unit, as it would with any. I think this pusher has got some really great features, the fact that this feels chunkier. So uh, for me, it's been really great. Um, and I look forward to lots more adventures.